If you're a fan of Freegal, you may have noticed that the website and app recently had a makeover. If you're new to Freegal or just need a refresher, I'm going to show you how to use this service to get free music. If you're using a smartphone or tablet, search for Freegal in the App Store on your device. Today, I'm using a computer to access Freegal. Let's start off on westervillelibrary.org. We'll click on Books, Movies, and More and click on ebooks and more. Scroll down to find Freakle Music and click. This page gives us some helpful information about Freakle. You'll have access to 15 million songs. You can stream up to eight hours a day, and every week you have five downloads that are yours to keep. Since I'm on the computer, I'm going to click on web version. Let's go to the upper right hand corner and click login. Type in your card number. The first time you log in, you'll be prompted to accept the terms and conditions. It will also ask you if you would like to get reminder emails to use your downloads every week. If you would like them, you can enter your email address. If not, just click the X. Let's take a look around. If you used Freegal before the update, you probably noticed that it looks pretty different, but most of your options are still there. You can browse the home page to find new arrivals and music that's trending. You can also use the search bar at the top of the page. Search for an artist, song, or album. I'm going to look up Tori Amos. That's the last concert that I went to. You can see there are results for the artist, as well as individual songs, and whole albums. If I hover on an album, I can see a few different options. I can click the heart to add it to my favorites, or I can click the playlist button to add it to a playlist. If I just want to stream the album, I can click on the play button. If I click on the album, but not the play button, I'll go to a page all about the album. There are a number of buttons to the right of each song. Again, I can add to favorites or to a playlist. I can also add to my wish list. You might use the wish list to keep track of songs you want to download in the future. If I'm ready to download a song, I can click on the download button. If I forget how many downloads I have left or how many streaming hours I have, I can check that at the top of the page. There are a number of navigation options on the left-hand side of the page. If I click on my music, I can see my playlists, favorites, and downloads. I can also access each of these areas directly from the menu on the left. Something to be aware of. Freegal recommends backing up the music you download, as they are unable to restore your downloads if you lose access to those files. If you download songs using the app, be aware that uninstalling the app will delete the music that you have downloaded. If you need help with Freegal or any of our other downloadable services, Send us an email at answers at westervillelibrary.org or give us a call at 882-7277, option 4. Happy listening!